fun. I've been playing Brave Eduardo for... I beat the demo for 11, 12 times now, and it's about an hour and 30 minutes, uh, an hour and 40 minutes to beat everything. My god, that's a little bit over 15 hours of gameplay, and it is uh, really good. I am surprised. Drew spent a lot of time on the combat, and the combat actually feels hard and... Uh, hard to master it's uh because you're dealing with gravity so when you're juggling them just a small small tip out there for people who are going to play it juggling enemies is the best way to deal damage without taking damage back it's the safest way to deal damage um it's really fun i'm surprised uh drew got to play through the game a lot too he really liked the mansion part uh, I'm, for those who have followed us for a while the mansion is, is the uh, c point estate uh he thought that was the best part of the game which i am very very honored um but uh yeah it's it's been mostly that so i don't actually have too much to show because we've been just playing the game and it's funny because we the, after the first game the first playthrough i'm like uh, i got a page of problems i got fixed and i fixed all that and i'm like all right yeah i got this this is easy the next playthrough second playthrough i'll be done nope after the second one i got a whole page of problems i got fixed again and then the third one and the fourth one up to the 12th one and we still have some troubles uh, mainly is optimization there are some parts where uh, I don't know if you guys saw, but in the game when you're trying to pick up things, there's these uh, sparkling that happen. They're played with animation, but it's very, very inefficient, and there are tons of these things. So uh, after this, uh, after I record this, I am going to go back and fix that. Um, but yeah, so uh, the pitch deck is one page away. Shrija did a fantastic job and cleaned up a lot of things. So I don't know if you guys know, but like in pitch deck, you don't want to have too many words, and there's like one page where it's like. Like a like a paragraph, and uh, Shrija changed it all into uh, icons, and looks so much nicer now, much easier to see. And we're kind of excited to see what people think when we send out the pitch deck. So, uh, pitch deck continuously fixing and playing through the game. Most of the problems are just like layers uh, overlapping each other, but there are some bigger ones, such as there's this one bug in the uh <laughs> there's this one big bug if you're cooking with three materials rather than four uh the game the the cooking just locks up forever so we had to fix that and there are tons of other things that drew really really fixed up too um there's this one really really big one where whenever you uh run through the checkpoint system with temporary stamina you lose permanent stamina forever and i found that because when I, one of my best playthroughs i had 180 something stamina but by the time i was uh, 180 100 something stamina by the time i got to the colossus i had 18 that means something was going on while i was going through it but yeah that's fixed most of the stuff is fixed so feels great but i don't have too much to show you guys so i just want to say thank you guys for being patient and uh hopefully next week we can start going back to finishing the game